Montana has one of the most diverse butterfly populations in the United States. We caught a small glimpse when naturalist Byron Weber took us on a hike in western Montana. When you think of all the habitats that we have around here, it's not surprising. You have mountain habitats, you have higher plateaus, you have this wonderful prairie uh, grass that we have in eastern Montana. We have badland countries, sagebrush. We have alpine countries. So it's not surprising we have 212 species of butterfly in the state. Byron Weber has been interested in butterflies his whole life, but only in the last decade has he seriously pursued it. He's worked with groups all over the state recording and observing butterflies. With a net made of fine mesh and an appropriate pair of tweezers, he showed us the swallowtail butterfly's proboscis. Uncoiled, it acts like a straw for butterflies to drink the nectar plants produce. This painted lady butterfly searches for nectar and shows that knapweed is good for something in Montana. As we continued our hike, we came across one of the few butterflies you can find in every county of the state. It's called the morning cloak, named because its dark colors resemble a cloak worn during a time of grieving or mourning. In 2001, it was officially named the state butterfly of Montana. The morning cloak is the one I certainly would have picked. It's easy to recognize. There's really only two colors. There's just a light streak on the outside and, and the rest of it is pretty dark. It also comes out in the first warm days of spring, which means that it hibernated as an adult. So I like it because it stays here in Montana in the wintertime, it doesn't migrate. To get started observing butterflies, Byron recommended exploring in your own backyard. There could be opportunities to watch a caterpillar mature into a butterfly. But out on the trail, you never know what you might see. We found this tree with a fresh flow of sap. It created a feeding frenzy for these hornets, but there were butterflies trying to join in. This red admiral butterfly is flashing its colors to intimidate the hornets, but it's not working. Nearby, there is more butterfly diversity. A common wood nymph is searching for food. This zephyr angle wing seems perfectly camouflaged on a tree limb. All the while, the hornets continue to push back any butterfly advances. It's an exciting array of activities just outside our back doors. Butterflies, to me, uh, just paint this kind of idyllic state that uh, I appreciate. They just bring peacefulness to me. And the more I observe them, the more fascinated I am with them. Yes, I'm bound to roam. And when I'm in off the road now, boys, Montana is my home. Coming in off the road now, boys, you know I'm heading home.